What's up, y'all? Um, this is gonna be a video uh, in Florida. You know, we out here. Uh, I wanna talk to you about, um, I wanna talk to you about your imagination and how powerful your imagination truly is. Throughout, not just this trip, but throughout many, many, uh, many months, I've realized that your thoughts will always create your actions and your habits and your doing. And it's about just you creating and breaking that cycle that your parents or even your grandparents have made and you you taking that imagination and building it into something of your own when you're able to use your imagination for an upward spiral in life you're honestly like i, I just said it here you, you're able to fucking Use it to, to do anything you want with your life. To enjoy a fucking trip. To enjoy experiences. To open your mind. To give you more finances, a better body. And I fucking, I, it just happened. With, with positivity and surrounding yourself with a great environment, with great people, people who only want the best for you. It's going to change you as a person. It's gonna shift your mindset. And understand when I say this is that there's either fear or you using that fear and taking it to reach your goals. And many people use it as fear. Some people let fear be fuel to their car. And some people let fear just take that over. They will run out. Of, they will run out of gas because fear is too strong, and it all depends on how big of an imagination you have. Because imagination creates pictures and images in your mind, and that itself is so powerful. And we don't we don't even realize how our brain is so powerful. We can use it. I, uh, as I said, our brain is so powerful, and we can use that to create abundance. Use that, that thought that you have and put it into action without thinking about it. And just doing it, things will fall into place. And not even just your finances, but your mental state, you won't be inside of your head. You'll be able to get outside of your head. Your, your physical, your spiritual self, you'll be getting yourself better every single day, 1% better every single day. And eventually, your finances will fall into place too. And life itself will fall into place. Because as me, Mr. High Off Life saying, life is all you need. So all I wanna say is pure imagination, stick to your roots, become the best version of you, surrounding yourself with an environment. Three tips, an environment, Meditation and hard work. Hard fucking work ethic. Stick to that. And use your brain to create discipline. Whether it's within your work, your physical self, your mental self, whatever you're dealing with. And instead of letting those emotions go to waste and reacting to things, it all starts with you not reacting to your emotions, the way you feel, your behavior, the way you react to certain situations. If your parents, for example, are getting pissed off at you or something, it's always better to hold that and realize that you aren't that fucking emotion. They are that emotion. They are the ones reacting to that, but not even you. So it doesn't mean you have to become a follower if they are becoming a follower. It doesn't mean you have to react to emotions if they are reacting to emotions. The moment you start react, reacting is the moment you lose already. But the moment you keep these reactions and these behaviors and these emotions within you, 
then you will realize that with over time you create this new habit you create this new feeling inside of you like wow i just stuck this inside myself without having to react to it and things fucking changed i feel like a new person a new man and you create this new realm of thought a new perspective i think that's it I just wanted to reach out today and uh, talk about that. Please don't run. These streets won't love you like I do. I can't love. But maybe with you I can try to. I don't rush. But baby, with you I would like to. Life ain't done. If you leave, then how will I find you?